Welcome back to A Pearl in Every Cow's Lips Seer. This is CLE Language Arts 400, Book 2. It's raw footage recorded right here in the classroom. Hope you enjoy. Okay, fourth grade, lesson 11. We had a quiz we've done. Okay. Check but lesson 11. Possessive nouns as adjectives. A few questions. What reference do you use to find the pages where you study something like planets? What reference would you use to find maybe where you study planets? Encyclopedia. You can find information about encyclopedias uh, about planets in oh, encyclopedia. But you'd find look in the index for where does this book talk about planets? An index about everything. When you scan, what do you look for? A specific word. Which we call a keyword. A keyword. Which reference books have information about many people and places? Famous. Um. Encyclopedia. Encyclopedia. Encyclopedia has information about a wide range of things. Are encyclopedias always true? No. No, no sometimes they're not. Let's look at the first sentence and divide it between the subject and the verb. What is the verb? The bear cub scrambled up the tall pine tree. Scrambled up the tall pine tree. Good. That's the complete verb. And the complete subject is the bear cubs. We'll divide it right there. Okay, I have a noun. My noun is Sam. Okay, that could be like the subject of a sentence, something like that. Sam ran. Okay, there's a bear coming. <laughs> the bear comes, scrambled up, and Sam ran. But we can take that Sam, that noun, Sam ran, and change it from a noun, and let's make it possessive. We talk about Sam's cat. Now, is Sam a noun? No, no. No, what is the noun? Hat. Hat. And Sam is telling whose hat it is. So when we, words that tell whose are what part of speech? Which words tell whose, what kind, which, um, how many? Adjectives. adjectives. you nail it. So it becomes an adjective. Sam changes from a noun to an adjective. What was a noun, when we make it possessive, becomes an adjective to saying whose. Where is the possessive noun in the sentence? It ducks, eggs, and ducks. And what does it modify? Eggs, eggs. Eggs. Perfect. What's the possessive noun here? Trees. Trees. And what does it modify? Limbs. Good. Limbs. And what's the adjective here? Cups. 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 And what does it modify? Handle. 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 Good. Let's diagram this last one. The cups handle broke. The verb is? Verb? Broke. 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 Or what broke? Handle. Handle. I like the handle first. Remember, these possessive nouns will never ever be subjects. Possessive s words are never ever subjects. They always always are adjectives. And adjectives go under here like this. The and cups. The cups handle broke. So be very careful when you go to find subjects. Let's circle the subjects in these words. Subject eggs, subject limbs, subject handle. Okay, before I let you go with your lesson, I'm going to read the spelling words just so you know how they sound. Clothes, clothes, collar, elbow, forehead, handkerchief, human, knuckle, scarf, shawl. Shoulder, stomach, throat, thumb, wrist. A lot of people words, a lot of clothes words, and body part words. Carry on with your lesson.